get to meet an army officer. One day there was an army camp selection at school in which Gattu came first. As the Indian army thought to visit our school and give our students a chance to go to the camp for which the selection process took place and some children of our school were selected for Indian army camp visit. Among them Gattu, Chinki and Bhushan have been selected. Gattu and Chinki got very excited after hearing this because Gattu had the ambition of meeting an army officer from a very long time and now his wish was about to come true. Wow, congratulations Chinki, we got selected. Yes Gattu, now we will be able to visit the Indian army camp. Tried last year also but could not succeed. Let's go home soon, we have to prepare too. Gattu Chinki came home and started telling mummy and papa about the Indian army camp. Very good, Gattu Chinki. Indian Army is always ready to protect the country. You will get to learn many things by watching them. And I'm sure you both will definitely get to learn many things from the Army. My kids will go to the camp. Mom lovingly appreciated Gattu and Chinki. Thank you so much, Mom. Gattu Chinki, who else is with you? Dad, Bhushan has also been selected with us and school teachers will also be with us. Okay, okay. Then go to sleep soon. And set the alarm. Both of you will have to get up early. Yes. Gattu Chinki went to sleep. The next morning, Gattu and Chinki got up before the alarm went off. Gattu and Chinki woke mom up. Mom made all the preparations for Gattu and Chinki. Gattu put on a khaki cap on his head and got ready to meet the army officer with sports shoes. Chinki also wore an army colored frock. Both of them were very excited. Early in the morning, Gattu reached the Indian Army camp with Chinki, Bhushan and the school teachers. Gattu Chinki saw a huge ground where tents of army officers were set up and a large army troop was standing in a careful position. Sir, will we be able to talk to the officers as well? Yes, yes, why not Gattu? You can also ask your questions. Gattu felt very happy. Gattu, I'm scared. Look how strong the army officers look. Pointing to the army officers troop, Chinki said from a distance. Gattu Chinki and Bhushan, as you have passed the selection process, that's why you got the chance. For now, we will see some part of an army officers training. Gattu Chinki and Bhushan sat on the chairs kept at a distance from the army troops. Army officers were training with their group. An army officer was giving instructions to everyone with a stick. Shortly, the training of the army officer troop was stopped. Teacher brought Gattu, Chinki and Bhushan with him to introduce them to the army officer. Hello Major, these are the promising kids from our school who have passed the selection process for this camp and everyone is looking forward to meeting you. The teacher started talking to the army officer. Congratulations kids, did you like the training? Gattu, Chinki were almost scared by the stern voice of the army officer. Yes, sir. We saw the training. Yes, sir. We found the training very tough. Kids! No need to be afraid like this, kids. These are dangerous for enemies, but soft-hearted enough for kids like you. So don't worry and talk to them. <laughs> you are right, sir. The teacher left from there in no time. Now Gattu, Chinki and Bhushan stood around the army officer. Why is army training so strict? Sir, we just saw how you were instructing everyone with a stick. Son, we do not want to leave any stone unturned in securing our country. That's why by taking strict training, we prepare ourselves in such a way that even when the enemies suddenly attack, we do not waver, but stand firm. Sir, the gun you have in your hands, can I also use it? Hey Gattu, what are you saying? It is not a toy gun. It is a real one. Well said, Chinky. This is called a rifle. There are many types of rifles. It takes many days to get trained with it. Only after that, you become smooth with it. Oh, well, this rifle is going to be quite heavy, isn't it, sir? Yes, it is quite heavy. Then the teacher came there. Got to Chinky Bhushan. Come. Let us have dinner with the army officer. Yes, Gattu, Chinki and Bhushan. You guys go. I will come after giving instructions to my troops. Gattu, Chinki and Bhushan started walking with the teacher. 
but then Gattu stopped there and started following the army officer. Gattu, you don't want to go. Sir, let me stay with you. I'll stand still. Please, sir, please. Okay, no problem. Parade, stand at ease. Parade, attention. The army troop performed the actions in the same manner as per the instructions of the army officer. At the same time, Gattu also followed the army officer and started taking action the same way. The army officer was standing straight, but still he looked down and saw Gattu, and a smile appeared on his face. Parade, turn right. Simultaneously, the drill of the army officer started. Gattu stood quietly watching the parade. Gattu understood the first instructions very well, and he also observed the whole troop very carefully. After that, on the next instruction, Gattu also started drilling well. Army officers were happy to see Gattu. Soon, the drilling of the army group ended. Cadets, this is Gattu. By following everyone, Gattu has done every action correctly. Army troops smiled seeing Gattu. Gattu, you have done all the actions very well. I am very happy for you. Thank you very much, sir. I have seen army officers like you only on TV or in the Rajput parade. Today, when I am seeing everyone in front of me, I am feeling very happy, sir. The army officer put his hand on Gattu's shoulder and said, "Very good, Gattu. The children of the country having such sentiments about the army, it gives us even more enthusiasm. Along with me, all the other cadets are also happy to see you, son. To be a great person." Whether you become an army officer or not, always work for your country. Wishing you the very best of luck. A deep smile appeared on Gattu's face. <laughs>